Hi, my name is Salida and this is my capstone three. I will be doing a skill demo over the deep system in the lower extremity legs. First, I'm gonna go ahead and put on some gloves before touching the patient nor the equipment. For this protocol, we're gonna go ahead and use a linear probe, which is best used for vascular imaging. I'm then gonna go ahead and apply some gel onto the probe. The patient should be in supine position with the knee slightly flexed out. I'm then gonna go ahead and rip up the shorts because I am going to be scanning from the groin to the knee. Before starting the exam, I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick sweep with the prox thigh, mid thigh, and distal thigh, as well as behind the knee. As for the deep system, I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the common femoral vein. In transposition, I'm gonna go ahead and get a dual image of non-compression and compression of the CFE. I then wanna go ahead and turn the CFE into sagittal position and also apply colors so we know the direction of the blood is moving as well as the angle box. We're then gonna go ahead and apply PW, which stands for pulse wave. This helps us reflect sound waves between the pulses in each vessel. Also, make sure to adjust your baseline in your horizontal sweep. We're then gonna go ahead and move to the FV, which stands for femoral vein. Okay, we're gonna get a dual image of non-compression and compression of the FV. We're gonna go ahead and turn the FV into sagittal position and also apply color so we know which direction the blood is moving. Same as the CFE, we're going to go ahead and apply PW onto the FV. Next, we're going to go ahead and go to the popliteal vein where we're going to get a dual image of non-compressed and compressed of the popliteal vein. Also, it is very important to change your annotation as well. You're then going to go ahead and turn the probe sagittal position onto the popliteal vein. Also, make sure to get color as well as pulse wave Doppler. Once the protocol is finished, you're gonna go ahead and grab a paper towel and wipe down the patient. You're then gonna go ahead and get a sanitation spray and wipe down the probe with the paper towel, but always make sure to wipe down carefully. Once finished with the patient, you're gonna go ahead and wrap up the paper sheet and get a brand new one so that we can work on our next new patient. And that is my capstone three skill demo. Thank you so much for watching.